Hi guys, so in today's video I'm going to show you guys three really easy um, hairstyles for any occasion really. These can be for school, for an occasion. They're really great for when you have dirty hair. Um, you don't have to have your hair curled or anything. I just have mine like that a lot of the time, so this is just what I have. But it's total preference to what, you know, how messy you want it to look and everything. But yeah, I'm not gonna ramble on about it because I don't think you care to hear me, you know, jabber jabber. So we're gonna get right on in to my hair and hairstyles. We're gonna get right into the video. So really quickly, I want to talk about my hair before I get into the hairstyles. Um, I get a ton of questions on my hair, so I want to tell you about what I use, how I keep it healthy, um, all of that. So I actually, I think this is like a huge thing for me and my hair, is that I don't wash my hair every day or every other day. I wash my hair every three to four, even five days sometimes, depending on how it looks. And I just use like dry shampoo throughout that week or whatever, how many days of not washing. I use a lot of dry shampoo, whatever, style it, brush it. That's what I do. It keeps my hair very moisturized towards the ends, which I do balayage my hair. So, you know, keeping moisture through that is very important. So I don't like to wash it because I think that can dry your hair out a lot if you wash it every day. By the end of the week, or by the end of the four or five days, my hair is a lot of built up of dry shampoo, hairspray, any product I might have in it. There's just a lot of build up through my scalp, through my roots just in my hair in general, so I love using this Whey Detoxifying Shampoo. It's for all hair types, it's safe for my balayage hair that I get done. It is really, really good to do once a week to reset my hair because just, you know, dry shampoo will build up over time. Any product will, oils, anything. This really clarifies my hair and scalp without drying my hair out. Because again, putting bleach on it and using heat does dry out my ends like already, so I don't want to strip my hair, but I do want to, you know, clarify it from product um, buildup, oils, like bad oils, um, stuff like that once a week. And this is an amazing product. It's made with apple cider vinegar, but it doesn't smell bad. Don't worry. It actually smells freaking awesome. It is so, so good. So if you are looking for something to, you know, change your hair routine, try to have healthier, thicker, um, longer lasting hair, I would definitely check out The Way products. You can just go to theway.com and check them all out. They're really freaking good. <laughs> I would train your hair to not have to wash it every day. Use dry shampoo and then when you go in for that wash, use this detoxifying shampoo to clean it because it's really good. And you guys can get 15% off using my code Messler on theway.com. T-H-E-O-U-A-I.com. And then my code MESSLER for 15% off of your entire order. So I would definitely check it out. Mm, yeah, this is like fourth or fifth day hair. It really does clarify your hair and give you like a restart to start off on a new week. So yeah, um, I really love it. I would really recommend it. You guys can click the link in my description box below and get 15% off. So now we're gonna get right into the hairstyles. <laughs> so the first hairstyle I'm going to do is a hairstyle I would do if my hair wasn't too like dirty. <laughs> so if I'm on like second, third day hair and it's not too like greasy to where I can still wear it down and it looks good. Um, hold on, I need to grab a little rough hands. <laughs> this is a hairstyle that I would do for, you know, having my hair down when it's still not too greasy, but it's like really cute. So yeah, we're gonna get right into it. So I just use these clear rubber bands. Wow, dude. Um, clear rubber bands. You can use like whatever matches your hair better. I just like these clear ones because they don't like stand out too much. And I'm gonna start off by grabbing a section of hair, like not here. I mean, if you're into that, you can. I just don't like to like lift these, my forehead's big. So I just grab like from like back here and I kind of get a section of hair like so. And I'm just going to rubber band right there. It's super easy. Boom, just like that. Cute, see? And basically just rubber band all the way down. That ponytail is so freaking simple. So easy, so cute. You just like. <laughs> Dude, what are you barking at? <laughs> um, make them into little bubbles. Cute, 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 cute. And then you literally just like spread them out, make them bigger. Thank you. 
and then you repeat on the other side, which I'm gonna do off camera so that this video is not like 20 minutes of me putting hair ties in my hair. <laughs> okay, so I did it on the other side and this is what it looks like. I think it's so cute. If you wanted to, you could add little clips on them to spice it up for whatever you're doing or whatever occasion you're going to. I think this hairstyle is really fun, really functional and cute and great for, you know, just, I don't know, any occasion, I think it's really cute for school, college, high school, whatever you want. It really just spices up your look. I think this one's really fun and cute. And it's so easy. Anybody can do it. Just get some rubber bands and put them in your hair. Um, your hair doesn't have to be curled. It can be straight. It can be natural. It can be whatever you want it to be. And I think it's just really cute. So, yeah. Let's get into the next hairstyle. Okay, so you're going to want to grab, like, pieces of hair out of the front like this on both sides like that that's good I'm gonna clip them off so that they're not just in my way and then you're gonna want to put your hair into a ponytail like that <laughs> unclip your ponytail I'm gonna brush my little pieces out <laughs> um, you can pull out at this time any hairs you want like in the front dangling or whatever so now you're gonna grab your pieces and just like make sure they're smooth. Bounce bother me. Like a five year old when you have like a bump in your hair and you're like, uh, what? Maybe that was just me though. <laughs> Ooh, literally don't even have to brush the wrong way. <laughs> okay. Then you're gonna grab just a little rubber band again. A little rubber band and tie them off. Make sure there's like a big enough gap and you want to twist. Twist. And then pull your ponytail through. And then you can like re-tighten your underneath part if you want. And then just fluff your ponytail, make adjustments that you want. Fluff it, maybe tease it a little bit if you want. Um, okay, so not paying attention to my front pieces because I don't have legit bangs, but here is the look from the front and then the back. It pretty much just makes your ponytail look a lot fancier. It covers the hair tie and just has this really pretty like twist to it. So I think, you know, this is very classy. I think it look, would look so good with certain outfits and if you just want your hair like pulled back. I think this is a really cute option and it just like is a fancy ponytail pretty much so it's really easy. So yeah, this is this hairstyle. Look, hairstyle. Now I have one more. It's another ponytail that's really cute. Um, it's a little more fun, bubbly, gets your hair out of your face. That's cute. So we're going to do that now. Okay, <laughs> this last hairstyle is another ponytail and I just this one's really fun and really cute. It's kind of a combination of the first two hairstyles, basically. So, we are gonna put our hair in a ponytail to start. I'm just gonna throw it up there. Um, you can do like a slick back ponytail if that's what you're into. Again, I don't like to slick my hair back because of, I just don't like it on myself, but, um, put your hair in a ponytail. My hair, I like to pull out the pieces that I want out, which would basically be like these pieces and stuff. Um. So, I'm doing that. <laughs> okay, ponytail your hair. Do a nice little ponytail. Just like that. And then, <laughs> we, I'm gonna like pull these, like puff it a little bit. Not time, just like a little bit. Now we are going to grab a bobby pin. I have these like tiny ones. And grab a little underneath section of hair. Like so, and just wrap that around your ponytail. Now, if you don't like the way this method of covering up your ponytail looks, you could totally do the last method if you wanted to. Covers that hair tie, and now we're gonna get a little rubber bands and make little bubbles. <laughs> it's so cute, so simple, and so fun. It really spices up any look, I think. 
you know, I don't know, just any look you're going for, I think it makes it so cute. This would be such a good, cute work hairstyle. And if you have thinner hair, I think this hairstyle looks so good because you fluff it out and it can make your hair look a lot thicker than it is. So if you're looking to have like a thicker look to your hair, this is a really good hairstyle because you can just like spread out the bubbles and it makes your hair look a lot thicker. But don't leave it like this because this isn't very cute. <laughs> um, literally just make them as big as you want. So fun. And there it is, boom, fun, so cute. So cute, so cute, so cute. You can whack someone with it if you had to. And it's just really simple and cute. <laughs> That is all the hairstyles for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed this. It's different than some of my other videos. And I just hope you guys liked the hairstyles. If you like this video, comment, tell me, because I'll do more. Um, I actually love like trying new hairstyles because you know I get bored of the same look every day sometimes. So yeah, if you enjoyed this video, comment down below. Definitely go check out Way. They have amazing products. Don't forget to subscribe if you are new here. Hi, subscribe. Hello. Um, I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. I love you and goodbye.